the news for Tucson investigators and several purse snatchings outside local grocery stores. One alleged victim is so outraged that the woman charged in her case is not behind bars right now. News for Tucson investigator Matthew Schwartz has details in a story you'll see only on News 4. I am shaken up. I cannot sleep. I replayed in my mind over and over and again what happened. I'm angry. She's afraid to be identified because the people who robbed her may know where she lives. The 70-year-old woman's purse was stolen in broad daylight last month from her shopping cart outside Fry's at Speedway and Pantano while she was putting groceries in her car. The robbers got her social security card, driver's license, and credit cards. And she's outraged that the prime suspect is walking the streets. I feel that they know everything about my life and I'm in danger for the rest of my life now. She could have been seriously hurt because the getaway car nearly ran her over. An eyewitness snapped a photo of the license plate. The next day at this hotel, Tucson police arrested the woman they say is the purse snatcher. Court records show 23-year-old Kristen Brown was charged not only with this theft, but with another purse snatching a month earlier at the Fry's on East 22nd near Kolb. And police say Brown is a suspect in two more recent purse snatchings for a total of four. One at another Fry's, another in a Safeway parking lot. They say her boyfriend is suspected of being the getaway driver in at least one case. This was um, basically um, people with drug addictions who needed money to, to support their habit. But there's more. Court records show that Kristen Brown has been charged with at least four crimes in the past five months. In March, she was charged with criminal damage. That case is still pending. In June, she was found guilty of committing a lewd and lascivious act, ordered to pay fines and court fees, totaling $395. In July, charged with the two thefts outside Fry's. On July 25th, city court judge Susan Shedder released Brown on her own recognizance. No bond required. She was released within hours before the, the reports were even done. What do you think of that? I think the justice system has a lot to answer people for. I would call it concerning. Uh, someone that, that's out committing crimes like this, multiple crimes, is back on our streets. We called Judge Shedder numerous times to try to find out why Kristen Brown was released on her own recognizance while she's charged in two thefts and is a suspect in two others. The judge has not returned our calls. The police work so hard to catch those people and get them out of the street puts them in jail, and within hours, they're out again. Kristen Brown is charged with misdemeanors, and the Pima County Jail is overcrowded. But the alleged victim is worried that if there's another purse snatching, someone could get seriously hurt or killed. If you have a story you'd like us to investigate, email us at investigators at kvoa.com or call 955-4444. Matthew Schwartz, News 4, Tucson.